like the Bible is just so full of contradictions that it can't be trusted. But honestly, I have yet to find a contradiction. Um, the problem is, is that if you actually a read what the Bible actually says, and and then uh, ten consider it in its context, you know how it was written back then. People don't didn't write back then how they do now, and uh, sometimes people just get lazy and, and they and they want so bad for it to not be true that they don't even do the legwork. Uh, a good example of this is uh, whether or not everyone will be saved who calls on the name of the Lord. So if you read in Acts two twenty one, it says this. And it shall be that everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. So there is the obvious point that I want to make before I actually look at this, that oftentimes in ancient literature, all doesn't mean lit necessarily every single person. However, I don't think that's the case here. I think here it's very obvious through the context here, and also it's this the same uh, the same part is quoted, I believe, twice in the New Testament, and it also appears in the Old Testament. And so I don't really think that the, you know, that's the case. I, I think that it should be understood as literal. Um, all who call on the name of the Lord will be saved. So that takes us to Matthew um, chapter 7, verse 21. And it says, hold on, let me go down. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but he who does the will of my Father who is in heaven will enter. So... People say and look at that and they say, well, we'll see, it just said not everyone who calls on the name of the Lord. Well, um, hold on. There's something called context. Basically, you can make anybody or anything say anything you want if you ignore the context. What's the context? Well, like, let's say, for instance, I'm saying something to you. I'm saying, um, I love my wife and I own a dog. Now, let's say that you picked and chose what from that sentence to keep. I love my dog. Well, my wife is no longer even a part of that sentence. You took my words out of context because I didn't say that I love my dog. I said that I love my wife and that I own a dog. Big difference. So what people do with the Bible is they do something very, very similar. They just yank things out of context and then say, see, the Bible contradicts itself. Well, actually, no. First off, if you read the rest of the verse itself, it already explains itself. But hold on, hold on. Um, but he who does the will of my father, basically what he's saying is people who pretend to be Christian or who go by Christian in name, you, you don't get bonus points for pretending to be something. If you're in a garage, you're not a car, right? And if you look at the rest of the chapter, he's actually talking about the verse and about, about fake people. And if you go just right before, like literally two sentences before, Every tree that does not bear good fruit is cut down and thrown into the fire. So then you will know them by their fruits. He's talking about fake people, false prophets, false teachers. And then he go and then after talking about knowing false people by their fruit, then he goes on to say, not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven. See, it's not about the external show. It's about what is in your heart. And that's why he says, but those who do the will of my Father. And if you look back throughout the whole chapter, it starts out with judging people, then it goes to the golden rule, then it goes to the narrow and the wide gates. Enter through the narrow gate, for the gate is wide and, and uh, the way is broad that leads to destruction. And then he's going to talk about beware of the false prophets who uh, come to you in sheep's clothing. And then he goes to not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord. So once again, that's not a contradiction. That is not understanding and not taking the time to try to understand. You can make anything sound like a contradiction if you don't actually do the legwork of reading it, but in this, there is no con no contradiction there. Um, nothing else to say?